so I finished up my fairy garden and want to give you a quick tour. So we start out with the little gnome couple who are welcoming you to the garden. And I got this set at Big Lots. Uh, it was a season end sale. It was 50% off and they're just too cute to pass up. Uh, the mushroom in the back is from Dollar Tree. And then I got this also at Big Lots. Little teepee. And the little gnomes with their campfire. And then over here is um, many different items that I bought at Dollar Tree over the years. Um, back here, there's a little wishing well. And then a little pond. That pond is actually from Michael's. And then the little houses and the fairies. Love the little lamp post as well. Then back here have a little mushroom house and another little gnome couple. And they've got their little clothesline. Thought that was adorable. And then we come down the path and we come to the fairy garden village. So here's an overhead view of the village. And we'll start with this piece here. This is a tree stump that I purchased at Michael's and that back there with the fence and the sunflowers my neighbor gave to me when she found out I was doing a fairy garden. Uh, the fairy I got at Amazon so I'll put a link below. The chair and tables are from Michael's and then the other little objects are all from Dollar Tree. Then that little apple tree also came from my neighbor. I thought that was really adorable. And then this birdhouse, um, you'll see it in my 2018 tour. And so I got this in Michael's and decorated it, painted it and added a few touches. And then this fairy came from Amazon. I'll put a link below. She's painting a cute little flower. This one also came from Amazon and I liked it so much because it reminded me of me and my sister. So I thought it'd be cute to have us in the garden. That mushroom came from Big Lots. This one also came from Big Lots and the slide came from Dollar Tree. I've had her for many years. You'll see her, I think, um, in a couple of my videos. So she came from Michael's. The pond came from Big Lots and the swan and ducklings came from my neighbor. Then this little teapot house came from Michael's and the bench and the little flowers in the back came from um, Tuesday morning several years back and then the fairy was from Amazon. I'll put a link below. I just got her. I've been eyeing her for years and just so happy I got her. She's so adorable. Then I've got this house that I bought at Michael's. This little fairy also came from Michael's holding a little watering can. One thing I wanted to also show you is, I don't think I did it yet, usually with a lot of my items, the small ones, I add, I glue on a little um, golf tee and that way when I stick, put them in the ground, they stay put, they don't move around. So that's a tip. And here's this fairy that I got at Big Lots she swings so you can um, and then this birdhouse that I uh, painted and decorated from Michaels and then over here we've got a little fairy door that I bought many years ago so you'll see this also in a couple of my videos and this is what started it all. I fell in love with this. Tiptoe, please. Fairies are dreaming. My absolute favorite. And then this little fairy from Big Lots with the riding a llama. And I got her because I just love llamas. 
so why not so that's it for this tour thank you so much for watching bye